three reasons that you no longer want to drink alkaline water. Rule number one, your body already maintains its own pH balance. And so when you put alkaline water found here like Essentia, the first ingredient is baking soda. That's a buffer. And when you're putting that internally, your body has to compensate for that somehow. And so it's gonna shift off your balance. And each tissue and organ and blood system in your body has its own pH. And some pHs, like your small intestine, has to be acid. If it's alkaline, you can actually get cancer there too. So the whole myth that you heard that cancer does not live in an alkaline environment is absolutely untrue because your small intestine is alkaline, it can still get cancer. So number one, alkaline water can shift your body's pH. You become too alkaline called alkalosis. You go into a coma and you can actually pass away. Number two, is that when you're drinking a lot of this, your body has a hard time with all these minerals because a lot of times there's calcium, magnesium, potassium, sodium added to the water in the form that your body has a harder time utilizing. So what ends up happening is it builds up in your tissues, calcium deposits, kidney stones, and can even lead to glaucoma. So you definitely don't want that. And then you get a bone spur and it's because you drank too much alkaline water. And the last thing here is that you are gonna have to spend a lot of money to buy this water. Think about the cost of this water. Essentially here is about $2.50 a bottle. If you're trying to maintain hydration, you're gonna need two or three a day. Spending $10 a day to drink bottled water, $300 a month, $2,000 a year, and then how long do you drink water for? It's very expensive and all you're buying is filtered water through reverse osmosis with adding in baking soda and other minerals. So there is three reasons for you not to drink alkaline water any longer.